Hey beauties, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I achieved this hair and this supernatural no makeup makeup look. So if you're interested in seeing how I did it, stay tuned. So as you can see, we are starting off with some super poofy, curly, overnight hair. And if you're like me, your hair just gets bigger and bigger every single day. And I love this look for just your every once in a while, carefree, wild child type of hairdo. But for today, with the outfit that I'm wearing, I wanted to go for something a little more refined. So I'm doing a flat twist to the back, kind of, and securing it with several bobby pins because my hair is thick. And if you don't secure it with a ton of bobby pins, it will come undone. <laughs> So I'm basically doing the same thing on the other side, just a little bit more loose because it's a bigger section so it's kind of hard to get tight, but just secure that down with a couple of bobby pins too so it doesn't pop off. <laughs> now I put it in a half up half down ponytail and then I go on to makeup. So our first product of the day is some under eye concealer because your girl's got bags. She does. She doesn't sleep. And so concealer is my absolute best friend and I just apply that to some red areas on my face and just some spots that I feel need some extra coverage. My skin is kind of light so sometimes when I tan I don't tan evenly so concealer helps with that as well especially in the summertime. I'm just going in with this foundation brush. I don't wear foundation anymore but the foundation brush does a great job of blending the concealer. That's all done. I like to go in with some eyelash primer and the eyelash primer just does a great job of elongating your eyelashes, separating them so that when you apply the mascara, your eyelashes look super wispy and natural, which is what we're going for. After that, I apply some super shimmery lip gloss because we want to glow, baby. Glow, 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 especially in the sunshine. Great for that. Then I just add some powder to my eyebrows. I don't like to use a dip brow or a pomade just because I like my eyelashes, eyebrows, to look natural. I don't like it to look like I filled them in at all. Um, just, I like to make them a little bit darker so that the eyelashes, oh my gosh, I said it again. Eyebrows don't have so many caps. I'm a mess, forgive me guys. Then I softly brush some concealer directly beneath my eyebrows just so that they're a little bit sharper. And the brush that I was using, it still had some leftover product from when I last used it to fill in my eyebrows. So that's why there are some dark marks, but I went back and cleaned them up with some concealer. Just dabbing on some highlight, which is my favorite part personally because it gives you that little bit of glow that you need for the summertime. It just looks really nice when the sun hits and so it's nice to apply that to the nose, the eyebrows, and the cheeks. And that's the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> 